So what happened with this guy I thought was the Austin Bomber is that I went to the bar to get a cigarette because it was before I'd quit cigarettes and um, no one was there. He, this guy was inside. He followed me outside. Um, it was like he was following me around and he was trying to meet me and I did meet him and uh, he, he kept trying to start a fight with this other guy and I kept trying to calm him down. Um, and he was hanging out with this other guy who looked like an MMA guy and that guy um, got kind of mad at me because I was accusing certain people in the government of blackmailing Donald Trump and um, could I be wrong about Donald Trump being blackmailed by certain people in the military or intelligence community to pick people for certain positions yes but no matter what I did piss people off and so I think I pissed off this guy that told me he was an explosives expert that worked for an oil and gas company. And um, so things are getting a little stiff in our conversation and there are two of them and there's one of me and then there's this other guy. And um, I told him, I don't fight people, I kill people. So if you try to fight me, I'm just gonna kill you. And that's that's my philosophy because I, if you try to fight me, I, I think you're trying to kill me. So I'm just gonna kill you. And, um, and then, the guy I thought was the Austin bomber, he booked it and left. And then the other guy told me that he wanted to start a civil war. And then I suddenly realized that this was a bad situation because this guy had just left and I, something in me told me, get out of here. So I, I ran. I mean, I literally ran to my car and got out of there because I, I felt like th this guy was about to come back and it was going to be a bad situation. Um, so that's what, hap that's what happened. And then I wrote on the internet a description of him late thirties, beer belly. Um, and then the next day, the, um, I, I said he was short. Um, the next day, uh, the video appeared and it was the, it was him, but it was his body. It looked like, but you never really know. Um, and, the, but you couldn't see his face. And then the guy blew himself up and it was like, bam, bam, bam. It was like over the moment I, I reported it. And I, I told my friend who worked, for the FBI at one point about it um, and I feel like I was a jerk about it but at that time dude you have to understand everyone was trying to fight me like everywhere I went I, it was like like it felt like people were trying to fight me and um, that was like I said I, I think I don't I don't know if I said that was the second time that week I told someone I'd kill him um, because I don't I said I don't fight people I kill them and, and that was before I carried a gun and then the guy blew himself up and so after that happened, then I told everyone that followed me on the internet, don't pay your taxes until the confession is released because the Huffington Post um, came out with this article about how um, every, how people were lying about this youth group. This guy, he was a homeschool kid and he was part of a homeschool group and they were lying, saying that it was like the survivalist training group, that they were like this crazy group of kids. And really they were just Christians that had water balloon fights and went bowling. I know homeschool kids. I went to homeschool prom. Um, they're just normal kids. They're not sitting there. Yeah, we used to sit around talking about how to make bombs. Yeah, right. No, there, there's no way. And that's what the Huffington Post said. And then I talked about it on the internet and then it was taken off, off the internet right away. And that's why I think it, no matter what, there was a cover up. And um, that's what I believe. Um, and I might be wrong. Um, I feel like this is a bad time to talk about it, but um, I, I also have suddenly realized that with Twitter, I can tag people. And that's why I, I feel like, a, who, who should I tag? Um, someone should hear this story because you guys can go listen to the Austin Bombers confession. Go listen to it. And um, I can't listen to it. So you should go listen to it.